Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Oracle of Seasons. We're in the Den of the Poison Moth. It's episode 7 and day 15 of isolation because of coronavirus. Which seems to have now been taken to being called COVID-19. Like both names are floating around for a while and they seem to have swapped around. I don't want to know why. Also this video is been recorded some time ago so may maybe it's all over maybe it's far worse fucking die you bastards um rock's feather was up and this just leads to no there was step there were steps here wasn't there yeah I unfortunately died last time, so I'm having to retrace my steps a certain amount. Fucking jump out. It looks like I'm gonna die again because I'm I'm not taking this as seriously as I should be. Rather like coronavirus no, no it's not. It's really nothing to talk about. God some people are entitled though, aren't they? Nice. So I can't get that. I have to jump on this middle one, ride it to the end, then around, then the ladders, and across. That must have been like a real proper puzzle back in the day. It's piss easy now, but back in the day... I can push this without the need for the power bracelet, but not other things. I've just started thinking... Is this the first, like, proper trampoline in a Zelda game? Like, not just the first, is it the only one? I'm trying to think any other examples of trampolines. There's, like, plants and shit that will make you jump, I feel, but... Full-on trampolines. This is a way out. Like, that hit game, a way out. Which I've got in my head as being called a ways out. You know the one, it's like the like the telltale style storytelling for two guys escaping prison. Don't think it did very well. I think it required co-op quite heavily. You know what, I went down those stairs last time. I'm, I'm actually going to solve this little trampoline puzzle. It's weird having like a physical item like that that you can just flat out jump over. It's... It's just, it doesn't happen very much in Zelda. I, I can't, you could never jump over a block like that. Even though reasonably there's no reason you shouldn't be able to. Behold. Right, I've got to hit pause immediately after this goes away. Now I have to turn and stab immediately after I close this screen. Damn it, damn it, damn it. So amazingly, I managed to, after dying, get my way back to this little area and have the exact same amount of health as I did the first time I was here. However, I will attempt to kill the bats before I do anything else. Okay, that spawned the heart, but because it, it jumped off screen, I couldn't have it. Was that good? Oh, I, I suddenly thought that would go to the ceiling and would crush me. Like in Mission Impossible. To... Is it Emilio Estevez who got crushed in the elevator shaft? Possible. I recognise this. This... I know where this comes out. I didn't need to go through all that agony. I could have just walked. It's like seconds... It's so far... It's so close to the entrance. I'm going to go back to the entrance to heal up. And die on my way there. Bastards. So, I got a um, one of the Xbox Super Elite, whatever controllers they're called. I've been using that a lot recently. And I didn't realise how much nicer the control pad is on that compared to on a GameCube. Like, the GameCube's got a shitty control pad as it is. It's, it's way too goddamn small. But, it's, it's just hitting me now. So, I'm having to... For some reason, my my thumbs have become weak and 
What's the word? I want to I use the word bourgeoisie, or, but that's not right. So I've got to now play with the control pad, uh, the thumbstick, which is fine in the top down, but it, it just doesn't feel right in the uh, side scrolling sections. Right. I'm ready. I'm jizzed up. No, it's not, not a good use to that word, is it? Oh, so those spots don't respawn, the other ones do. Don't think the enemies will be back, but just in case, we're ready. So I've got to go through the room with the hands, and then I've got to jump over that button that makes the floor fall away. Fuck you fucking hands. I hate these bastards. They also look really weirdly creepy to me. Uh, like it's, it's like they've gone for it to make them look that weird. I don't want to get the, uh, the bracelet out. That's what, that's why I'm just pushing all the pots instead of smashing them like any normal link would. Nice. I'm gonna ignore all that entirely. And just a little hop over that. I feel like this is actually quite a new thing in Zelda. I've not really had a puzzle before where you just have to jump over a button. <gasps> oh, boss fight. Okay. Okay. I want this out. Okay, can't block that. Okay, what have we learned? Yeah, I did nothing. Um, might have to make them shoot themselves. Since I can't block it. Okay, that would have been cool, but it's not the answer. Maybe just hit him with my sword. No? Right. Yeah, I'm slowly running out of ideas here. What have we got left that I haven't tried? Bombs are an option, but a difficult one. And didn't do anything anyway. Definitely didn't do anything. And they, the mouths don't open long enough for that to work. Maybe this. Okay. I didn't think that would be the answer, honestly. They're hideous, aren't they? They really are. It really bugs me they do damage to you just by the flopping as well. Good. One down. One should be near death as well. Next one. Yes. Fuck. Alright. This is fine. This is fine. Fairy. Give me a fairy, you bitch. Don't fly off. I need you. <laughs> right. Oh, there is a way out in it. I, I was thinking, if, if that's just a dead end, that really hasn't helped me. I was going to say, this room was full of those flying things, which may be called pea hats. But I'm convinced I'll have to kill at some point. Ah, so this is just a ledge you can jump across. I better do it now, just to yeah, test my theory. Um, so that's the boss door. Oh, I take it this is just how you get to it, yeah. Don't need to even go down there, because I haven't got the key yet. Oh. Huh. You don't need to actually use the rock's cover, just walking up makes you jump over. I'm really tempted to just walk up to that and see what happens if you don't have the rock's feather equipped, if you just jump down or what. Oh, this is where we are from the start. Right. Ok, 
Okay. Eh. Yep, suddenly remembered that as an option. Can I just push it again? No. There we are. And I got the key. Alright, so we should actually. This should be. Oh, bollocks. Damn it, I was doing so well, and then I just walked into that at the end. Um. Oh, good. And the only upside is to, to swing all the way back around there, I can now heal up beforehand. How did I get around there, though? Am I on bombs? Am I on bombs? Eight bombs. Should be plenty. Well, I know what the enemy is in this dungeon. Oh, it's a moth, isn't it? I do know what it is. It's called Lair of the Poison Moth, and we're yet to see anything poison moth related. Okay. Um, yeah, so I went over the... over the falling floor, through the, through the blue hand room. Not in that order. They should respawn, yeah. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. That one nearly spawned on me. That would have done me in. I'd have been dead. There's no coming back from that. Well, I'd have walked back, but it would have been annoying. Oh, God, I've just realised. If they respawn every time you go in there, which they very well might, if you fuck up this puzzle, you have to, you have to fight them again. That'd be a bastard if you didn't realise. Though I don't think they do respawn. I think there's a little bit of a window on it. Yeah, I was just thinking. I never actually investigated up here. Fuck it. There must, there's a chest up here somewhere. Won't be anything good. I'm thinking Geisha Seed. Yeah. Gasha Seed. Jash, Jassa? Jasher. There's not really a good way of saying it. Still don't have to go through that again. I lost a whole heart for that. Unless. The worst part about dying when I did was knowing full well that soon enough you'll get like potions or, or fairy bottles or, or essentially some way to prevent your death outside of your own hearts. Okay, good. I've just tested my hypothesis. You can, you don't need the rocks ever at all to get across that. Oh no, pea hats are everywhere. Get out of there. All right, here's the enemy. Oh, it's a moth. I bet if you fall down, it restarts the fight. Oh, there might just be a way back up, actually. That's more likely. You know what, it was worth just taking the hit for all the all the hits I got in. Yeah. Really that offense was key. So these lead down, so does that mean Oh, that's where you'd have fallen. Okay, so you can just jump back up. But I wonder if it would have healed. Because that'd be a bastard if it does. You got the bright sun, an essence of nature. Young shoots grow quickly under the warm rays of the bright sun. Oh, shit. <laughs> Did that by accident. The funny thing is, if you start in this fat mode, stretched out, you won't even notice it is, and when you go back, it will be weird. So really, I should have started in the stretched mode, because it, you know, overall, you kind of get used to it. Thank you, Beta. I too feel the bright sun. But the powers of darkness do not weaken. Instead, they grow stronger. How can this be? Beta! I dreamt of the waterfall on the mountain north of Sunken City. Perhaps the next essence is near there. So the waterfall north of the mountain on Sunken City? Was that right? I'm going to make it... To I bet winter would be more useful. Because if this is frozen, I can probably get through all of it. Yeah. Because it was it was autumn before, so 
anything other than autumn is probably like a an advantage. Was there treasure? I feel like there was treasure. Maybe not. Can this bear break the ice? No. No, didn't think it could. Also, I noticed that the, the, the deeper water down below hadn't frozen anyway. Thus, all pointless. So, I've got to go to the north. Have I got anything else to do? No. Who's... What is this place? Who are these crazy people? I'm the mother of Mamamu Yan, Labrina's top dog breeder. This fellow is from Labrina, too, but we met here by chance. Can you help me? Yeah, yeah, I can. Can you tell this secret to my daughter, Mamumu Yan? Yep, let me just get my notepad ready. By which I mean my phone for picture taking. Yep, what's the secret? The secret is... That's an easier one. Normally they're much harder than that, aren't they? Okay, I got it. Please tell my daughter. Will do. Did you open the floodgates? The vines there get so overgrown in summer. Did I? Have I already done this place? I've... I've genuinely... N oh, shit. Um, yeah, I can run now, can't I? I feel like I must have been here, but I'm really not sure. Okay. I wonder if I actually need this at all. Yeah. This does look familiar, but I feel like I came here without the power bracelet, maybe? Hmm. My mind is not what it once was. One of these is an enemy. I'm sure of it. Did I have the bracelet? I don't know. Oh, yeah, it's got to lead somewhere, though, isn't it? In fact, I, f I feel like I do recognise this, because I reckon this might be the first place you come across those crab enemies. I mean, it doesn't, doesn't matter. Oh, a plot. Yep. Again, I'm never going to come back there, am I? I reckon I did. I got. I think they gave me the key, and I, I opened the floodgates. South of the floodgates is a strange vortex. Oh, and I brought a shield off him, didn't I? That's why I had no money. Yes. It's all coming back to me now. Thank God I can just jump down. Um, I'm trying to leave this place, aren't I? Can I warp yet? No. How do you warp in this game? No earthly clue. Can you warp in this game? I don't know, actually. Could I warp in the other one? Gale seeds, that's how you do it. It's all coming back to me. It's all, it's all up here. Oh yeah, that's where it just unceremoniously gives you the seed, isn't it? I should have made it summer, that's what I should do. Get the map out. Where am I? Where in the hell am I? Where does this lead then? Leads to a different place. Oh no, it just leads. It's the same place, just a different season. Sorry, mate, you can't come through here. Oh, is this Evil's Tower? What? No. It's just a shop. I feel like those symbols should mean something. Oh, Mabel. Make a bit of space. Alright, potion, then ring. They're the main attractions. Yeah, she went for the ring first. That was the error. Oh, there's a fucking rupee there. Ha! Now you're sorry. I have more stuff than before. See ya! Yeah, but I got the potion, which is good at this stage, because they're quite hard to attain. 
Um, annoyingly, her being there deleted Moose from appearing. Which isn't too bad. Hello, old woman. What? Wasn't my thanks enough? If you can swim, take a dip. Not yet. Soon I'll swim. And they'll be glorious, their enemies. I want to go back to town is what I want to do. I don't know why I want to do that, though. I already know I need to go to the mountains. These plants look very suspicious. Apparently, they were not. They were doing nothing wrong. I accused them for nothing. Boosh, come to me. I need your powers. The range on that is far better than it looks, isn't it? You think it's going to be quite narrow, but it will it'll just twat things for a great distance. I met Ricky, didn't I? The kangaroo. Just That just came back to me. What's the dragon's name? Is it Diego? Oh, we can't fly over that. What was up there? Far, far east sunken sea. It's far too far. Try, try to find a ride. So that's, sunk, that's sunken sea. That's where I've got to go. We decided that was nothing, didn't we? So I've got to cross this bridge. Oh, fuck me. I thought I was safe from them, even though not two minutes ago they attacked me. And there goes my health. Brilliant. i got to be more careful. Maybe I should get a ring that gets more hearts. Currently trying to dig up some hearts. It's not a good plan. Oh, scent seeds. They're useless. Why do I care? I'm probably going to dig up a snake, which will just kill me before I dig up any hearts. In fact, can you dig up hearts, or can you only dig up money in this? Bushes, no. Nope. And in hero mode, there's no hearts at all. Fuck, that guy nearly killed me. Um, hey, mister in the boxing... Wait, have I actually got any gale seeds? I don't think I do, but I never really checked. Mystery, Pegasus, Scent, and Ember. No. It's fine. Then one minute. Ah, oh, thank God. Right. Fuck me. That one snake almost undid all the hearts I just found. Right. Spool Swamp, Plano's Gym. Ah, ah, it's cut. Nope. Thought it was coming back to me, but it wasn't. I'm really lost. I've no idea where I'm going. Moosh is going to show up on the wrong screen, I know it. Yep, you fucking idiot. I think it's random which entrance he appears from, so sometimes it's useful. Most of the time it's not. I could probably have jumped that with a combination uh, of... What's it called? The... Um, Pegasus seeds and the rocks flowers. Hmm. So they have to be on the ground to take damage from that. It's fair. It makes sense. I don't like the fact they can damage me in the air, though. I like to believe I'm invincible when I'm riding my bear. It's true in life as it is in the game. I don't know why I thought that would be a useful way to go. Shit. It's quite hard to stop where you want to. Are they on crack? They're moving really fast, aren't they? Hey. Love, love the seed. What a great song. Don't you agree? Uh, yeah, it's a good song. Here's a human, I understand. Let me fill your statue for you. Okay. That was weird. That was weird. That was... Weird. There's... I feel like there should be more to say, but no, there's not. It was just really weird. 
Does it also bug you? There'll never be a situation where you'll it'll be you in the middle of eight bushes in a square pattern and you get to slash all of them at once. For two reasons. One, to even get in that position you'd have to fall into it. And two, if you did, you'd have to cut one of the bushes to get your sword out to charge the attack. It's it's infuriating, isn't it? Oh look, little castle. Where the fuck am I going? I Oh wow. You. You boy. What day is it? Are you here to harass me again? But my power is grown. He'll never get inside my fortress. I shall get my revenge. Bombs away. This dude's got a cannon. Oh, they all shoot at you. It's good to know. Okay, oh, okay, now I've got a route back. And if I just go through here, it's the village. Nearly. Where the fuck is the village? Eastern suburbs. That sounds like a village, doesn't it? Is it just down? No. I'm close, but not quite there, am I? Ah, this. I think this is it. Nope. This isn't it. I don't need this. Even though I'm, t I'm tempted to get him, I don't need him. I just got. I'm, I'm like one screen away. It's like those horrible tales you hear of people dying in blizzards, going like to their outdoor shed or whatever because they get lost, and in the morning it turns out they were, they were only inches away from safety. I can't get over that with him, can I? He doesn't like the water. But I can, I can, I can get over it. If I jump correctly, I can get over it. Please tell me. Oh, damn it, it's Sabrosia. But it does mean I know exactly where I am. This is where you follow that Sabrosia. And I was going to say Pixie, that's a different thing. You follow it through the maze to get there. Why do I even want to go to go to the town? I don't know. Wait, did he have a boy before? You know what? That Right, I'm going to leave it there. That's the episode. But we'll find out if he's stolen a child next time. Uh, that's episode 7, I think. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.